Hello YouTube, how is everyone doing? It's Professional here. Welcome to the first part of my playthrough of Saints Row the Third Remastered. So this was a game that's have been heavily requested on my channel for a long time. A lot of people have requested me to play this game, and I was kind of debating on whether I would play this game or not. Um, and the reason for that is because if you've watched my Saints Row 1 and 2 playthroughs, you know how I feel about Saints Row 3 and 4. Um, I think that, and it's not that I hate Saints Row 3, I think that Saints Row 3 is a great game, but I just didn't think it was as good as Saints Row 2, personally, because I was a major Saints Row 2 fan. And so, um, we'll be playing through Saints Row the 3rd, because I still enjoy Saints Row the 3rd more than some of the things that I don't like. Um, Saints Row 4, maybe I'll do that in the future. And for people wondering, am I going to play the new Saints Row game that's coming out at the end of this month? Yeah, I'll give it a try. I'll play through it. A lot of people have been requesting it. Um, I think that some of the characters in the new Saints Row game are kind of cringe and aren't to me aren't like real gangsters, but I guess we'll take, we'll give the game a try also when that comes out, and I'll tell you guys what I think of it as I'm playing through it. So, here we're gonna be playing Saints Row the Third, and um, uh, this takes place like a few years after Saints Row 2, so this is the direct sequel to Saints Row 2. Um, it takes place in the city of Steelport, another open world game. Um, whether it's a gangster game, it's a little bit debatable, because there's a lot of ridiculousness in it, but um, I got my cosplay here, you know, purple uh, business, um, uh, purple business shirt. Um, uh, I got the vest, and I got the suit uh, jacket. So hope you guys enjoy this series. And if you do, please do drop a like if you guys enjoy this series. Helps me to make more content like this. But anyways, let's do it here. Uh, new game. Uh, and we'll play on hardcore here. Yeah, this is definitely a reference to Star Wars. The story of human history. Since the immen immemorial great leaders have risen from humble beginnings to... Do stuff. Huh. And so it was said the Third Street... Uh, and so it was with the Third Street Saints. Since conquering Stillwater, the once small-time street gang has evolved into a media empire. A Saints movie is in development. Uh, Johnny Gat and Shandy are pop culture icons. And Pierce? Well, <laughs> who cares about Pierce? <laughs> That's a reference to Saints Row 2 where they constantly made fun of him and didn't follow his plans. Um, the point is the Saints are on the world stage and every criminal organization wants their crown. It was only a matter of time before one of them took the fight to the Saints. And also, guys, take a look at something. I don't know if you can see it here, but the controller on the PS5 when you play Saints Row the Third Remastered actually glows purple, which that that is actually a nice um, uh, a nice addition. I think that's actually kind of cool. Yeah, this was some of the parts of the game that prohibited in California. Well, these these are some of the stuff that would like sometimes make Japanese me cringe in this game. Easiest money you'll ever make. <laughs> Grand Larson is right up there. You ready for this? No the worries. remaster's graphics are pretty good, though. I do my own stunts. Hey, you're just a ride along, man. So don't get all Hong Kong style in there. I am a method actor. If I'm gonna play a saint with any degree of emotional truth, I gotta make it real. Trust me, Burke. It'll be real. You're robbing a bank dressed like yourselves. Hell yeah. Who doesn't want to be Johnny Gat? Ultra postmodernism. I love it. I'm cool with the Saints movie, but do we really gotta drag this asshole actor around? Cut Josh some slack. He's just researching his part. Yeah, I hope he signed a waiver. All right, people. Nobody dies! Burke! Sorry, jumps his line. Can we, uh, can we go again? You all know the drill. Can I get a picture with the boss? 
Say sleaze. <laughs> Get in line, bitch. Hey, don't be a dick. Would you call yourself gangbangers? You're a bunch of pussies. We should be all up in their shit like fuck. <laughs> Oh, that's different. So the game does throw you right in the action at the start of it. Um, man, are we just shooting all these motherfuckers? That is my plan. Works for me. Where's the ball? Go to hell! You wanna play, motherfucker? Die? What happened to I do my own stunts? Hey, hey, do these look like scripts to you? All right, people, let's find that ball. That's oh. right, you fuckers! We're coming for ya! Look! Oh, oh, oh Jesus. Get up, Burke. Let's keep moving. I can't believe you launched that guy into a statue! So, the, the game starts out, they're robbing a bank in Stillwater, and they don't know who this bank, uh, who, who runs this bank. Ball. Let's find that and get the hell out of here. Is this what it's normally like? Normally, the tunnels don't use fucking shotguns. Yeah, normally banks don't look like a palace either. You see those statues before you blew them up? Will you forget the horses? These guards are packing military-grade hardware. Who the hell are we robbing? Oh. Trying to remember what the melee button was. Don't. I can't breathe. No way we're cracking this thing. Ready for plan B? Yep. Josh, get over here. Got the tools right here, Holmes. So, uh, what's plan B? Huh? We drill it? <laughs> Fuck no. We blow it. What? D not cool, man. Time to get to work. We'll need to set those above the vault. Hey, I think we've got company. Looks like they're coming in from the lobby. Shondi. What? We need to talk. We really don't. It's just, if I die here, I don't want things to go unsaid. I All this. So love oh my god! You're sign the autograph. You have to sign this for me! Anything for a fan. Hey, Josh Burke. Don't be starstruck. I'm very approachable. You want me to, uh, sign your breasts? Uh, no. That's alright. Yeah, you know. Buy Night Blade on DVD. Chopper, lift this baby out of here. Hey guys, you can call up the helicopter. Found the way to open the vault. Don't touch it. Oh man. Gosh, are you trying to get us all jail time? What? I don't want to be some dude's bitch. That's a panic button, by the way. Banks have that in real life. Little button underneath the table. Basically triggers a police response. How long until the chopper gets here? I don't know. Probably like two waves of SWAT guys. Sounds about right. Here they come! Flashbang! Good day. Ah! Oh. Okay, yeah, I gotta I gotta switch back to the assault rifle. This shotgun isn't doing it. I'm gonna kill Burke if I see him again! Oh, I thought you two really had something there. Oh, don't even go there. Hey, the same. Like old times, huh, Shondi? Man, I forgot how much some of these enemies are bullet sponges in this game. You think you can stop us? The chopper should be here soon. Just gotta hold out a little longer. They busted out the riot shields. He 
So yeah, I remember this part gets a bit crazy when the, once the helicopter comes in. Oh, what the? No, no, no. Really? A fucking attack chopper? Seriously, who are these guys? A bunch of assholes. So the helicopter boss is gonna be in a few stages. <laughs> Here's our ride. So yeah, that's a reference to Troy, who's still the chief of police, and he does bail the saints out whenever they need help. One of the best Saints Row characters also, and Troy is responsible for Saints Row 1 and 2 because he Hello, saved the boss's life in Saints Row 1 and 2. Saved him from getting killed by the Vice King in Saints Row 1, and saved him from uh, uh, getting the plug pulled in the prison uh, in Saints Row 2. Publicity stunt. Get us And also, this is really the last time that we're able to explore Stillwater, um, officially, um, uh, in a, in a Saints Row game chronologically. I don't really count the visions or, like, the, the pro, like, the, um, Matrix kind of thing in Saints Row 4. But this is in down, downtown Stillwater, this is the North Island where this is going on. You do come back to Stillwater in a cutscene in Saints Row 3 later on, but, uh, this is the first, last time we actually run around in Stillwater. Son wants to meet Shandy. Ah. That's right. Don't fuck with. No, 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 no. How many SWAT team members does Stillwater have? So this has been the most popular Saints Row game, and it's the game that the most people, most people in the Saints Row community are familiar with, is Saints Row the Third. Okay, so here we now customize our character. I'm gonna do this really quick, guys. Okay, I made my character. What is this? We paid up this month. Someone paid more. What happened? We got arrested. No, to us. Burke's right. We traded our dicks in for pussies. Seriously. Movie deals, commercials. Saint's name used to mean something more than body spray and some ass tasting energy drink. Our brand's worth a shitload of money. Is that what it's all about? It's always about the money, Mr. Gat. Which is precisely why our employer wishes to speak with you. If you'll indulge us. You have any idea who you're fucking with here? Of course. I actually like some of the characters' uh, appearances in the remaster better. 
Like, I think Loren and the sisters um, look better in uh, the remaster. Never heard of it. Loren does look a bit older, but I think he does look better. Evidently not, or you would not have robbed our bank. Perhaps you wonder why you are still breathing at this point. Actually, I wonder why my foot's not up your ass at this point. <laughs> like it or not, Mr. Gat, our organization is expanding into still water. I am offering you the chance to leverage your assets against your lives. Ladies? You may continue to operate the same Soul Tour Media Group as you see fit, in exchange for 66% of your monthly gross revenue. That is before taxes, of course. Listen, you French fuck. Please. I am Belgium. So make yourself a fucking waffle. <laughs> We're done here. And I had so hoped to come to a rational business arrangement. Johnny's always able to break free. I don't know if that would have. Well, boss, you got bail. No, not without. I don't know if that would have broken the plane's window by smashing his head on it. Feels like half a dozen guys. I can take him. What about the plane? I'll fly it back to Stillwater. Johnny, you can't even drive stick. How are you gonna fly a plane? Details, details. Just cover the boss. Go. I got this. Guy can take care of himself. We gotta deal with these guys. Attention passengers, this is your new captain speaking. Our updated flight plan has us landed in Stillwater. Some of the melee moves are really cool in Saints Row the Third. I'd like to remind all passengers to remain seated and enjoy the flight. Great. Who gave God a mic? It's Easter Open! Oh, I can see some of our passengers are getting restless. Here's some relaxing music for your enjoyment. <sighs> that wasn't much of a challenge. My apologies. Your captain is having troubles finding the clutch. Keep it up. Okay, and we got a gun now. Doors open in the cargo bay doors. Find some chutes and jump out the back. It should be clear. So, um, basically, the enemies in this game is kind of All weird. Right, um. Okay, let's get out of here first. on a hardcore so it is a bit harder um uh so um uh what i was trying to say what's what's weird is that the gangs in saints row the third so ah uh, okay okay so basically in Saints Row 1 and 2, you fought three gangs, but they had three different storylines. Where in Saints Row the Third, oh, I wonder if I can blow that up. Oh, I can. In Saints Row the Third, you fight three gangs, but they're all in one gang together, the Syndicate. Um, and so these guys, they're called the Morning Star. Um, yeah. Right on. I'll see you in still. Johnny. This is actually one of my favorite parts in this game, with the plane part. Where the fuck did you come from? Might as well turn up some little of the game volume here. Uh, uh, music. Because the, the soundtrack is actually pretty good in this part. Really? Oh. Ah. Oh. 
Die, dummy! I am the greatest! Flip, okay. Take this one out! Ah, uh, reload. You wanna just keep moving on this part? Oh, whoa. Okay. So this is now one of the most badass Saints Row moments of all time, this Super part. Fuck was I thinking? Oh, okay. Oh, that's a lot of more of them. Uh, try to figure out where they are. Oh. I always win. Whoa, 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 I think I'm gonna die here. Uh, no. Yeah, um, been some time since I played this game. I'm playing on a hardcore, too. Okay, um. Well, two out of four ain't bad. This time we got this. Okay. Take them down. Take this one out. Oh. Ah. Man, there's so many. Okay. You're dead. Ooh, I got them all. Okay. So there's three gangs, the Morning Star, which is kind of a European gang, um, these guys, then there's the, um, uh, there's the Deckers, and then the final gang, um... Negotiations were less than successful. Viola and Kiki will spread the word. Kilbane's gang, if remember what their name was. And the Saints are not welcome. Mr. Kilbane, gather your luchadores and bring me their leader's head. The luchadores, um, uh... Mr. Miller, Hack into the Saints' accounts, and leave them nothing. And so we unlock Shandi as a homie right at the start of the game, uh, because I guess we, uh, uh, we're already the boss, and you know we've taken over Stillwater in Saints Row 2.
So what you have, Mr. Gat, will be a message for all who oppose the Syndicate. There is no mercy, only death. Don't mourn your friend. You'll be joining him soon. Loren's gonna pay for this. We'll need a car. Sean, do you got any idea where we are? Steelport. It's kind of like Bangkok's abusive father. Been here before? Spring break. Great. What the fuck does field boss mean? You don't want to know. Okay, whatever. You know where we're going? Look, I was really high the last time I was here. Just drive. It'll come... Okay, going to friendly fire. Back to me. So, about getting a gun. Why don't you just look up friendly fire on your phone? What? It has GPS, right? Check your map. Wow, that still exists? What? That's where I used to score weed. We should let Pierce know what's up. I texted him. He's bringing the crew. Looks like we'll need more guns. Any ideas? Yeah, we raid the guard armory. They have one of those here? Right on. You can't be serious. We need guns, they have guns. I don't see the problem. Getting shot comes to mind. Blah, blah, bullets, blah, blah, blah. I just flew through a fucking plane. Also, a shitty idea. Whoa, Pierce, where'd you come from? I thought I was talking to Shondi. Well, what the? Not cool. Because, I mean, here's... NPC well, on the car. ...about everything and... All right, all right. We'll pick a fight with the military. Good times. Anyone from the spring break days still live around here? Yeah, I keep up with one of my exes. This place big enough for the crew? Purchase a weapon upgrade. So this is like, you know, one thing that Saints Row the Third did do better than Saints Row 2 is it like it allowed you to cut upgrade weapons. Uh, let's see, level two. Okay, increase the... F okay. Exit store, there we go. Where's this armory? Not far, it's on the GPS. Mike's on Hellish Children's Book. The sky has That's Jane Valderrama. Ten people are dead after several cars came raining out of the sky, crushing an apartment building in a fiery blaze. Dozens of bodies, along with a number of crates and mangled vehicles, filled the streets nearby. Looters raided the scene before the police arrived, salvaging car stereos and sex dolls from the debris. The city morgue has not released the names of the victims killed in what seems to be a mid-air accident, and no plane wreckage has been found. This is Jane Valderrama, with your Steelport Disaster Report. All right, the guns should all be in that warehouse. Great. How are we moving everything? Maybe you should have thought about that before attacking an armory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seriously, how are we gonna do it? Don't worry, Pierce has that covered. Oh, just push the gate, okay. Guess they're not letting us in. Shooting them probably doesn't help change their minds. So, um, what I was saying earlier is there's three gangs in one. They're called the Syndicate in this game. Um, oh, I forgot uh, R1 is to, you know, throw grenades. Uh, okay, here we go. Probably use, probably use the shotgun or this one. Uh, regen some health, because we're playing on the harder difficulty, so it's going to be um, a little bit more of a challenge, but I like challenges. Jeez, look at the size of that thing. That's not a hell of a way to end a gunfight. Good idea. I'll take it with and find out. Yeah, right. Wait, you're serious, aren't you? Wow, yeah. Some of the enemies are like massive bullet sponges. Find the weapons cache. Okay. 
Here's the weapons cache, and these look like UAV drone controls over here. Looks like UAV drone controls. Who the fuck says that? Okay, is this really the time? I'm just saying. UAV, um... Uh, that's basically like a big drone that flies in the sky that can do reconnaissance or can, you know, fire something. Uh, I guess we're gonna, yeah, switch to the handgun here, but... Oh, is that a tank outside? Hold your position. Do I have to get on a UAV drone right now? I'm sorry, you guys. I haven't played this game in so long. Um... Okay, so there isn't anything I have to do. I just have to literally just wait here. That's right. This really seemed like a better idea earlier on. You think? Pierce, where are you? You know me. I love to make an entrance. Dilly, the first, like, the first actual mission in this game, you're literally attacking the National Guard depot. If we're staying, maybe it's time oh. to try those UAV drones. Again with the UAV drones. Just okay, this is gonna be good now. Why are we getting the hell out of here? The boss won't leave without the bomb. You gotta be kidding me! Less bitching, more shooting. Oh, guided missile. Is that a tank? Yeah, those tanks are going to be the biggest threat to me here. Oh, I actually get to keep the drone? Okay. Yeah, it's been so many years since I played this game. I know Saints Row 2 like a little bit better, um, uh, but I still remember a huge chunk of this game. That bomb is going to come in handy later on. Once the helicopters are on fire, you don't need to shoot at them anymore. They'll go down on their own.
Oh, I can't get a shot here. That was a pretty fast landing with such a deadly bomb, Pierce. So what's next? What's next is you go back to Stillwater. What? No, this is my fight too. Girl, you don't get messy. Let us take care of business. Fuck you. I'm doing this for Johnny. All right. Well, if we're going to bring in the boys, we're going to need a new place. You're worried about real estate? We have guns. Let's use them. Relax, Shandi. We got it all covered. I think I will change my character's face a little bit um, uh, in the next part. But, um, yeah, so, like, the thing is, though, is the three gangs, like, work together. So you got the Deckers, which are a group of hackers, the Lucha Luchadores, which are, um, uh, they are, um, a Killbane's gang, and then you have the Morningstar, which are led by Loren. Johnny's ex's apartment is it okay? It's a crib. Equip the Re Reaper drone. I forgot that you could actually have that. Um. But I guess we'll leave it off here. Um. But I I always personally felt like um. Oh well, a lot of stuff here. Okay. Yeah. So I I personally felt like um uh. Like the Morning Star were the only real gang in this game um, that you fight. I didn't think that the you know the Luchadores and the Deckers were real gangs. Um, you know, a gang of like hacker college kids and then you know a gang of wrestlers. Um, that's at least you know how I felt about it. But um, uh, you know this game is still kind of fun. You know there is like you know it's not a bad game by any means. Um, uh, but I just personally think Saints Row 2 is the best one in the series. Um, but I guess we will, um, wrap it up here, guys. So thank you guys for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed this part. I'll have the next part up for you guys as soon as I can. Thank you once again, and take care, everyone.